Growing up for me, um, I'm a victim turned victimizer, and uh, I got all these negative beliefs that I was worthless, I wasn't good enough, that I was never going to amount to anything. And the way I felt about myself is how I treated other people. They were just disposable. Um, I got into drugs when I was 14. Well, I became so addicted to meth by the time I was 14 years old, I was using it daily. And this continued on throughout my teenage years until um, in 2006, I was sitting in jail facing a 20 year sentence. Um, I was sentenced to six years and uh, this is when I first also got introduced to the Bible. And I remember at first thinking, what do you want me to do with this? You know, I didn't want anything to do with God. I didn't believe that he could help me. I didn't even believe in him. And it was through those pages of that Bible I started to realize there was something bigger than myself. And um, I started to, you know, something started to change, but it didn't last very long. And about six months after I was released, I went right back to what I knew best, which was drugs and violence. And I found myself completely out of my mind, living in a tent in the woods in Alaska. Um, I remember I would be walking down the road and there would be people on the same side of the road as me and they'd see me and they'd cross to the other side. I was a pretty much a lost cause. Um, I thought this was just how it was going to be, that I was just going to be another statistic and eventually somebody was just going to either find me dead or I was going to end up going to prison for the rest of my life. And in 2017, August, um, I was found overdosed in a car and sent back to jail. And this is when I finally cried out to God and I asked him just to show me that he was real. And for the first time in my life, I had freedom. I didn't want to use drugs, and I haven't had a desire to use drugs since then. He completely removed that from me and delivered me from that. And that's a miracle. I, I don't need anything, and I don't have a desire to use it. And I, I wake up every day thanking God for that. And not only that, he gave me a brand new life. He sent me down here to Teen Challenge, not just to come to another program, to actually have a life worth living. Um, I have a future now. I, I, I just, I am just blown away with what God can do and what he is doing in my life. And I know he's calling me into the ministry and I know that I never ever have to look back there again. And I know that I can help other people and that's what it's all about. So thanks for hearing my testimony.